Hey guys, it's Moody Karen. Now, this is a thing that I kind of want your feedback on. I was thinking, I did a kind of partial series uh, in X and Y where I did rated replays where I would commentate over some rated Wi-Fi battles I had on Battlespot. This one is singles now. I can either do this post commentated or I can do it live commentated. I actually got really hyped for this because this was my first uh, Battlespot match in Oras. So really would appreciate your feedback and if you enjoyed this you can always leave a like down below and I totally appreciate that so let me know and I can always make these longer and include like two or three of them but I figure for something that's like really simple and really short if you want to like see what ORAS um, animations are like see what the Wi-Fi is like this is a really good example of that so I actually only had three Pokemon that qualified for the level 50 thing and those are the ones I brought the first one being Sceptile because I saw most of the team was like Tyranitar, Greninja, whatever. Uh, a lot of the team was actually weak uh, to my grass type attacks, so I figured I'd leave with that. But then once I let off with my Sceptile, he let off with Greninja. I assumed he was going to Ice Beam me. I, w I didn't want a Mega, I just felt like switching out, assuming I could just switch out into Greninja pretty safely. The only thing I'd have to worry about is in case he U turned, but I made a good call there. So. Now he ends up doing that. He's clearly Life Orb. I, by the way, do not have any items except for the Sceptile Light because, once again, I'm not that far in the game. I decided to Night Slash just because he was Water type, and I figured maybe in case he switches, at least I'll get damage off on something. And I, he Grass Lots me, and I live at 5, and I'm so hyped for that. I'm like, whoa. So I avoided that narrowly. However, he makes a really good play. He, she, their character is a she, but I don't know. And they go into Tyranitar and bring in the sand. Clearly, my net slash is not going to do a lot to them at all. And I'm going to die at the sand because I'm left with about, I think, 5 HP or 9 HP. That was a crit there. That was pitiful damage, Greninja. So, I almost, like, I almost U-turned expecting that too. But I'm like, nah, I'm going to play it safe. Because if anything, I can end up going into my Sceptile here. And my Sceptile, I'm like, you're special. And I actually really, really do like this moveset, so I ended up Mega Evolving, and here I have Focus Blast. I'm like, I know Tyranitar, you're bulky in the sand, but you're not living a Sceptile's Focus Blast. And of course, Focus Blast does the thing that it loves to do and misses. And it goes for Rock Tomb, lowers my speed, does a lot of damage, and it's it all no really, really annoying. Plus, I take some Sandstorm damage, I'm just like, not in a happy spot. I'm like, well, try the Focus Blast again, because, again... His Greninja would be weak to it. Tyranitar is weak to it, and it takes it out because the power of freaking Mega Sceptile is insane. And he also had a Mega Lucario, which would have been weak to it. So in the end, even if he decided to switch, he had no safe switch in. You can see right here because he goes into his Lucario, which at this point is his Mega. Now, one thing that I really thought was going to happen is he was just going to bull punch me if he's physical and kill me off or just attack me and kill me off. But he goes for a substitute. And just on the off chance that I outsped or he did not kill me off, I went for the hidden power that I have. I was hoping it's fire. Unfortunately, it wasn't fire because it wasn't very effective, but it still had so much power, it ended up breaking the substitute. I'm just like... Mega Sceptile, I think you're my new favorite Mega right now, and honestly, I am just like in love with you. And so here he ends up killing me off with the R Sphere, which is okay, because I know I have my Town Flame sitting in the back, sitting pretty, and I can just, you know, Brave Bird this thing to death. Except for one thing, this Town Flame does not have Brave Bird, it actually has Acrobatics, but he has no item to kind of make up for that. And it does not end up taking out the Lucario, but apparently he has nothing else to really hit me with, so he goes for the Flash Cannon here, brings me down to half, and it's going to bring me... And it's going to let me kill him off with an acrobatic. So here, I know that I can outspeed the Greninja. Even if he happened to have some sort of priority, I'd be able to outspeed that. And it would be no problem. And I get my very first battle spot win on my very first try. And honestly, I am so excited because this is just a lot of fun for me. So if you guys would like to see more of these, I'd really appreciate your feedback. I can include multiples. I can include two or three and one if you want the post-commentated ones. If you want a live-commentated one with all my hype and all my everything, then you can let me know too. And I could probably do two or three of those if these are too short for you. So as always, let me know. And I love you guys so much. And have a wonderful day. And bye.